Welcome to McLean Cellars, my friends. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Come up to the bar. Let's have a wine tasting. First question, do you love really, really, really good wine? Yes, you better, because if you don't, turn off this video and go home and watch Oprah. Because all we're doing here at McLean Cellars is drinking stupid good wine. Today, we're gonna go through one of our tasting flights. It's called our Canyon Flight. It includes two amazing white wines and three fantastic, fantastic red wines. In your kit, you've got everything you need to enjoy a fantastic and amazing experience with me. Me, Jason, I'm your host, Jason McLean, proprietor here at McLean Cellars. Now in your kit, you're gonna find all the tools you'll need. All you need to bring out is a good wine glass. Of course, I've got one, so I'm ready. Are you ready to get fun? You ready to get busy? You ready to drink some really good wine? All right, first one, let's open her up. It's called Open Arms. Open Arms is named after that fantastic, amazing, iconic song by Journey. That's right, we trademarked the name Open Arms because this is like one of my all-time favorite songs when I was in high school. Nothing beats this song, and the flavor will blow your mind, my friends. Let's take a taste of it right now. Make sure it's at temperature. We don't want any warm white wines here. So I hope you had your whites in the refrigerator and your reds in the wine refrigerator, just like a little tasting card said when we gave you the little packet. Give it a nice little swirl. When you get ready to taste your wine, it's really important that you allow the wine to go to the side of your tongue, left and right, and towards the back. The front, not as much because you got more taste buds on your sides. Let's enjoy this wine. It's a beautiful vignette with a touch of Roussan. Nice, silky flavoring taste. Mm. Soft cannons, a little huckleberry, pears, Granny Smith apples. Doesn't that sound good? Granny Smith apples. Oh my God, it's delicious. Mm. Ah, you'll love it. Every one of these wines on our website, we have a link on our site to tell you what to pair them with. So for example, our open arms over here, my wife likes to say, it pair this with a pan seared sea bass with a pistachio butter alongside a grilled hearts of romaine, red onions, lime, and a mango salsa dressing. Oh my God, are you hungry? I know I'm starving right now because that sounds too delightful. So go to our website. You can pick up a wonderful bottle of this Open Arms. But let me tell you something. The more you pair it with really good food, the more you'll enjoy it. It's phenomenal. Ready to go on? Here we go. Number two, it's our Camping in Clouds. That's right. Camping in Clouds, my friends, is named after years and years in an RV with my kids and my wife. That's right. I RV'd all over this country with my wife and my three kids. And we went to 56 different parks uh, in our motorhome. It was a lot of fun. Uh, but let me tell you something. After a while, all you want is a nice glass of wine by the fireplace and sit back and say, lovey, I'm not ready to talk to the kids today. And this is your experience today. Camping in Clouds. This one is a reserved based Roussan. Uh, it has a touch of Grenache Blanc, but it's more over 80% in the Roussan blend. This one here is gonna give you a little bit more of a silkiness, a nice full mouth feel. Are you ready? Let's enjoy some Camping in Clouds. Apricots. The apricots, this wine will offer to you will blow your socks off. Very smooth, very silky, and very genuine. Ah. This one came in at 91 points, by the way. Ah, I love it. If I'm gonna pair this with anything, my lovely wife likes to say this one here pairs great with an Australian lobster tail. Yeah, she's got good taste. With a honey garlic butter, and there's really nothing else to say about that. You know, put that with our Australian lobster tail, and you will flip out in every single way. Are you enjoying this moment? I know I am. It's as if you are here, being here in our lounge, allowing you to have a really good cocktail, an amazing wine cocktail, good drink, makes the world even better, doesn't it? Of course it does. 
All right, number three, we're going to go off to our red collection. Are you ready? Here we go. Last sip of that amazing, delightful Campion and Clouds. Time for the reds. A good red wine can literally open up an opportunity of thoughts for every single person who's drinking the wine. The wine can make you feel loving. It can make you feel excited. It can make you feel joyful. Most importantly, it should make you feel really, really, really good because the work and the labor that goes to a really, really good red wine, well, that's all it's about, is it not? It's about making sure your experience is second to none in every single way. So the first wine we're gonna taste is called Purpose Road. It's an amazing wine. Let me show you all about it. It's a Merlot Sangiovese. 75% Merlot, 25% Sangiovese. I refer to it as an introduction to red wine. This is your movie theater wine. You put this in a thermos, take it to the theater, and you'll enjoy yourself. Take a little taste and you will enjoy it. This is the wine I give to somebody who's just getting into wines or just getting into reds, and they're looking for something that's easy to drink, an everyday drinker that's easy, that everyone's gonna really, truly love. This is the one you fall in love with. Nice dark color, little plum on the nose, beautiful coloring, blackberries, a little hint of chocolate. Mm. See, Merlot is one of those bigger wines, heavier wines, but the Sangiovese is a, a lighter wine, a little smoother, a bigger tannin. Combining the two give you something to just fall in love with. It's absolutely fantastic. Purpose Road, my friends. Definitely a go-to for me. Enjoy it. Are you ready for more? I know I am. Here we go. 1955. That's a year that my father was at Chamblay Air Force Base in Chamblay, France. He met a girl in a cafe. She was beautiful, she was enchanting, she was a ballerina, and he fell head over heels. Before him and my mother, of course, many years before that one, but he fell head over heels. In those days, you don't have cell phones, she didn't have a telephone. She said, I'll be back at this place in a few days, come back and see me, I'd love to see you again. Well, we had to go back to the Air Force Base at the time, and he came back to find her, and he never saw her again. He loved that idea of this girl so much, the walks they took on that one evening together. He wrote a song about her called Darcella. If you go to our website, on the back, you'll see the lyrics of the song Darcella and the artist's illustration of what she looked like back then in 1955. My friends, this is our Darcella wine, the 2017 Cabernet Sauvignon. Serve it at temperature, and I guarantee that your night will get better every single moment you enjoy. Let's enjoy some Darcella. Nice, medium-bodied. Definitely some cherries. Bit of poison berries. Ah, are you ready? Cheers. Nothing beats a really good cab. This is gonna blow your mind. Ah. There you have it. It's Darcella. 2017, 100% Cabernet Sauvignon from the San Ynez Valley, made by yours truly, and a family favorite in every single way. Mm. That's some yumminess. Ready for more? Okay. We've got one more in your Canyon flight. One more, which I think the best way to call it is the Peace de Resistance. This one, my friend, is named after my family of five. We have five in our family, my three children, my amazing wife, Sophia, for 17, plus more than that, 18 years now. She is amazing, our kids are amazing. This is named after my family. Now, if I'm gonna name a wine after my family, it's got to be good, it's got to be amazing. Well, this one is. 
It's a double gold winner for the San Francisco Wine Chronicle competition. The largest wine competition, mind you, in North America. For 2020, this year, before the COVID-19 took place, our double gold goes to our five hearts. 96 points. And one of the first wines uh, that got us a 96 point rating. This one here is a Petite Syrah base. Uh, it's got a touch of Sangiovese and a touch of Merlot. This one here is my personal go-to. If I'm gonna be drinking by myself or with someone, which is the only way that I drink, by myself or with someone, I guarantee you I'll be drinking some Five Hearts. Petite Syrah is amazing, but when you add some Merlot, remember Merlot was inside of Purpose Road. Purpose Road, we just had it earlier, and the Sangiovese is also inside this one, and our Petite Syrah. Now, when I show you some Petite Syrahs in a different one of our flights, you will freak out. We've got about three or four different Petite Syrahs. But this one here is one of my all-time favorites. Ladies and gentlemen, 96 points, five hearts. Mm. Touch of cedar, dark cherries, black currant, definitely some touch of boysenberry. Very smooth, very, very smooth. If that doesn't freak you out, I don't know what will. Listen, I love making wine. I love having a tasting lounge here in Laguna Beach, one up in the Santa Barbara area in Buellton, and one that we're building as well, two new ones that we're building uh, out here in Orange County areas. I love making things that are amazing. And this is one of those wines that will most certainly bring love to you in such an amazing way. Making great wine is a joy. It's an experience that really can't be surpassed. I turned my entire life from left to right to do one simple thing, to make great wine for people who really love having a good time, like you. So any of the wines you experience today in this flight, any of the ones in our Canyon flight are available on our website. The link is right here on the video at McLeanTellers.com. Remember, all these flights, you can pick up as many of them as you like, but more than that one, pick up a few bottles. If you say to me, I love that Five Hearts, or I love that Darcella, or that Camping in Clouds, or any of the wines on today's Canyon flight, go to our website, pick it up. But when you do, make sure you sign up for our wine club. On our website, there's a link to join the wine club. You'll get 10, 20, 30% off all of our bottles, and you can have them shipped to you, brought to you, and you can join us for the parties. Join us for the grand openings. Join us for everything that we do that is absolutely fun. If you enjoyed this flight a lot, remember, there's always other flights available. We have our Laguna flight, of course, a canyon we just enjoyed, our Master, which is all reds, and our reserve flight. But there's more wines available at McLeanTillers.com. My friends, thank you so very much for enjoying great wine with me. Stupid good wine, we like to say. Most importantly, did you have fun? Did you enjoy yourself? Is your time at home better today than it was yesterday? And if it is, that's a cool thing. Thanks so very much. We'll see you next time as we enjoy really good wine together. Cheers.